Think Tank waterless toilets have numerous advantages over existing waterless and composting toilets. They are virtually airtight under normal operating conditions. They draw the ventilation air from outside. In contrast to other toilets which draw the ventilation air from the bathroom. With other toilets, you are rapidly blowing expensively heated or cooled air outside. Not so with the think tank. This can save a great deal of money over time, is more efficient and environmentally friendly. The think tank toilet uses a soft rubber gasket mounted in the underside of the lid. When the lid is closed, this gasket is pushed into the bowl and compresses, creating an airtight seal. This patented airtight design also means that it is very difficult for insects to enter the think tank toilet. Insects can be a problem with other waterless and composting toilets. In the event of a power failure, there is less likely to be odor from the think tank toilet because of this patented airtight seal. The think tank toilet is much easier to clean. Most waterless and composting toilets have a large bowl with a small trap door for the solid waste. A mess can result. The think tank waterless toilet utilizes a large chute with vertical walls. It's harder to make a mess. It needs much less cleaning. The unique patented trap door design allows men to stand when urinating in contrast to other toilets where men must sit. The trap door stays closed unless you are going number two. When it is closed, it is impossible for urine to end up in the solids bin, which can be a big problem with other toilets. Each time the trap door is opened and closed, this arm moves backwards and forwards. This advances the solid waste container very slightly each time. The reason for this is for the solid waste to be more evenly distributed inside the container, increasing capacity and reducing the frequency of emptying. The solid waste container is shown here without a compostable bag for clarity. When using the toilet, the container will be lined with a compostable bag, which makes emptying clean and easy. Inexpensive Generic compostable bags are used inside the think tank toilet. There is no need to buy expensive proprietary bags. Urine exits the toilet at the rear from this black fitting which is 7 inches high. And this can be led to the location of your choosing. Typically a grey water system, a French drain or a tank. It eliminates the need for a urine bottle which has to be emptied frequently and is inconvenient. These are the fans inside the think tank toilet. They are the best fans available. These fans have exceptionally high output, powerful static pressure, which is the force behind the air, are extremely quiet, and have an incredibly long lifespan. They are rated at 150,000 hours. The fans are also easy to remove and reinstall. When the time comes for a fan to be replaced, Anyone can do it, easily, with basic hand tools. Notice there are two fans shown. Most installations will only require the exhaust fan on the right. The intake fan on the left can be left disconnected unless you have very long intake pipes. You will therefore always have a spare fan. Most people ventilate their toilets through the wall, directly behind the toilet. The think tank pipes exit the rear of the toilet, meaning the pipes can go straight back and can be hidden. This is an attractive installation. Two 90 degree elbows are also included in case you need to ventilate through the roof or out the side. Rather than use flimsy hinges as commonly seen on other composting and waterless toilets, the think tank uses solid stainless steel pins. The pins are inserted through the midsection and the base A similar shorter pin fits between the seat and the lid.
It's incredibly strong and virtually indestructible. All metal parts are marine grade stainless steel. Only the best possible materials are used in the think tank toilet. The toilet is incredibly strong. The shell is rotationally molded like a whitewater kayak. This is the best and strongest way to make something like this in plastic. It's rated at 350 pounds plus. Definitely big guy approved.